What's up, everyone? Welcome back. So, yeah, gonna be doing some more Dark Cloud 2 today. Uh, but ahead of time, I should tell you guys, um, I am gonna be doing Dark Cloud 2 today. Uh, but I'm probably not gonna be able to do a whole lot of recording for you guys today, because I got some stuff I gotta do. Which, of course, kind of sucks, but is what it is, you know. Uh, earlier in the week, I didn't get to my, uh, playthrough of Left 4 Dead 2 either. Uh, because I was busy with going to the dentist and them basically telling me that I have like 500,000 cavities, which is, you know, that's fun. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's just been great. Um, yeah, I can't remember what the hell I was doing. Got a decent amount of bread. Okay. Yeah, I think I should actually be somewhat decent on supplies. Her armband thing is going to need some repairing. Oh, so he's still recovering skill points. Damn it. Okay. Let me see, because I want to say there's someone that recently went onto the train. Ah, <coughs> oh, bless me. Because I could have sworn I remembered something like that, that someone else went into the train. Oh. Oh, I can buy shit here. Okay. Ah, that is useful. What the fuck is this? Silver ball. Interesting. Light element. Bunch of different elements. Huh. That is most certainly good to know. Yeah, alright, cool. Yeah, that is definitely good to know. Alright, so if I'm ever running low on supplies, I can buy some shit. Also, I do want to keep things on the level with you guys, because I like to be honest about, like, how I go through playthroughs and shit. So I'm going to be honest with you guys, I am kind of shortening this recording session today, so I'm probably not going to do a whole hell of a lot. Uh, also because I really honestly think that in order to, you know, make this playthrough go a little bit smoother for me, because there have been times in this playthrough where it's been a little bit tight with, you know, cash and supplies and shit, I am probably going to do some off-screen training that I'm not going to record for you guys. I'm probably going to go back to some of the lower level dungeons and just grind on monsters and shit so I can gain XP and money and supplies and shit. Because um, again, I like to keep things honest with you guys, you know, I don't want to just come back and suddenly be level, you know, 10,000 and, you know, jump from like level 20 to level 1,000 without, you know, explaining myself to you guys. Because again, I like to keep everything on the level, you know, I like to be honest about that kind of shit. Um, so I am probably at some point, either like at, you know, at some point this week or next week or whatever, I am probably going to do some off screen, you know, grinding in the lower level dungeons and I would record it for you guys. But the thing is, is that I really don't think you guys want to watch me just going to the lower levels of the dungeons, you know, of some of the early dungeons and just, 
you know, grinding and killing monsters over and over and over and over and over and over and over again on the same level, because I think that'd be boring for you guys to watch. So I'm not going to record that for you guys, but I just want to be honest with how I'm going to go about that. Uh, because I feel like it'll help me out, you know, it'll give me more supplies, more money to work with, all that good shit. Uh, and I just feel like it'll help this playthrough go smoother. And honestly, I mean, I don't really necessarily mind uh, the process of grinding in dungeons. It's never been something that I've found particularly super interesting, but I don't mind it either, because usually I just, like, you know, put on my uh, headphones or whatever and blast some rock and roll and just go to town, you know, grinding on lower-level monsters and shit in the lower dungeons, and the lower levels of the first dungeon, anyway. And, uh, yeah, just killing monsters over and over and over again. So, I don't mind it personally, but, yeah. Uh, I am going to plan on doing that. Um, and for those of you out there who are like, multi-step, that's cheating, though, technically, isn't it? Uh, no, technically it is not cheating because it is allowed within the rules of the game. I'm not using any hacks. I'm not using any devices to help me cheat you know anything special i'm not you know hacking the game or modding it in any way i am using what is legitimately provided in the game to complete this playthrough that's how i always do my playthroughs i never use any mods or cheats or any shit like that for the most part and if i do use a cheat it is only a cheat that is available within the game itself that's the only time i ever use a cheat is if it's you know available within the game itself I don't use any external cheats or hacks or anything like that. So I use what is given to me in the game in order to complete the game. That's how I've always done things, and that's how I will always do things. Uh, but I just want to keep that on the level with you guys, that I am probably going to uh, do some off-screen grinding on some of the lower-level dungeons uh, in between this week and next week. So... Again, if I come back, like, you know, with a much higher level or whatever, that's going to be the reason why. So, I just want to keep that, again, I want to keep that on the level. Um, and, yeah, that's how it's going to be. And, uh, yeah. So, again, grinding, in my opinion, is a legitimate strategy to help you progress in these kinds of games. I did it in the original Dark Cloud a hell of a lot. I grinded a lot in that game, which really helped me in the later levels, because I kicked ass in that game. So. I am going to probably do that at some point, but again, I just wanted to let you guys know that ahead of time to, you know, again, keep things on the level, so to speak. Alright, so I am going to have a different party member than Cedric, though. I want to still allow him to build up his... Or rebuild up his uh, fucking... Uh, re assistance points, or whatever the hell they're called. I don't fucking remember. Head into the dungeon here and uh, kick some ass, have a good time, all that good shit. Alright, but either way, I'm going to go ahead and end this one here and then we will head into the dungeon. I know I spent most of this video just talking about shit, so I apologize. But yeah, I am going to cut this recording session a little short today because again, I do want to do some grinding before I get to some of the later dungeons in this, or later floors in this dungeon. Uh, cause I wanna, I feel like I'm a bit underpowered at the moment, and I wanna get more powered up, you know? So that's why I'm gonna do some grinding off screen. Also, I need more money and supplies. I wanna make this a bit easier on myself, if I'm being 100% honest. And again, I honestly feel like grinding is a legitimate strategy. You know, grinding on the lower level dungeons. I personally, again, I've always thought that that's a legitimate strategy because it is within the confines of the game. You are allowed to do that within the confines of the game, and if you are, then it's a legitimate strategy. That's just my personal opinion, but again, I'm just not going to record it for you guys, because again, I feel like it'd be boring for you guys to just watch me, you know, go around and just kill the same enemies on the same floor over and over and over again. So, uh, yeah, those are my thoughts on that, and uh, that's what I'm going to do for the future. Probably just going to do a couple floors today, nothing too 
super major. Uh, but either way, should be fun, so stay tuned. And uh, until next time, guys, peace out.